a big cruiserweight. He's He's down. Down. Fourteen stone, three pounds, five ounces. His professional record an excellent one. In 32 fights, 30 victories, including 20 wins by knockout, two defeats, and one draw. Over the past five years, he's undefeated. Winning 10 in a row, eight by knockout. Undefeated as a cruiserweight, he's the fighting pride of Liverpool and all of the United Kingdom. The former cruiserweight champion of the world, Tony Palmer. Billy Fifteen fights, fifteen victories, including eleven big wins by knockout, and he's ranked among the best as pound for pound the best in the world. From Kiev, Ukraine. The reigning, defending, undefeated, undisputed, cruiserweight champion of the world, Alexander Pusi. Is something in the air again? As Tony Belusic threw his complete authority at Cruiserweight. There you go. Wow, what an atmosphere. What a build up. Super Series. World Super Series of Boxing, which he won. They clean Tony Belusic off the back of the two David Hay fights. So, we're expecting to come in here to bring awareness. He knows where he is also. You know, he's, he's got bags of experience, amateur and professional. He's literally proficient and so busy. With his work, doesn't really look for power use in Bonning at all just yet. But he's still Timothy Turner is in Jackson, but it's hard to get the spine against his left hand of fighters. He felt his way through the round, he didn't take anything of any note. He's I giving me the fight to release. Maybe for the last time, Tony Belly. Alexander Usyk trying to cement his reputation. Sure. It's a momentous night. There's Usyk's jab, just That's get him in. So much at stake. Tony Bailey punches hard. You said to take his time for a couple of rounds and settle into this. And, and the bookmakers giving Bailey did Usyk by late stoppage or on points. Good shot from Bailey. You've got a good opportunity here as he tries to work the Usyk build up. That Usyk's been hurt to the body as an amateur. Listen, Tony Bailey getting closer and landing also with a right hand. This is good work from Tony Bailey early on. It's an excellent start. Well, this is all part of the mind game from Tony Bellew, and this is a slot. And the power will be the difference. It's a confidence to all this from Bellew. Really confident. He's sent for him in so he can land a big counter punch. And here he comes, Tony Bellew, not too long career. He's trying to confuse. Not let him get set. And when they get him close, he wants to unload. Because he's not, he's not doing too much. Why not make him a mistake? He was making him pay. He would do to use it for everybody. He really, really got a real foothold in the fight. In the first round, they had even this round. I don't want to see him. He's not going to win everything else. He's 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 going to win Some shots. So Bellu will be waiting with that right hand pound to be, which wasn't far. I mean, we just caught the end of that one there, but as you said, draws closer. Bellu, Bellu will be waiting for that. Boosting unbeaten, but he's walking into his right hands. Good right hand counter there from Tony Bellu. Nobody expected this. Many in Britain want Tony Bellu to triumph in his last. The Tesmate Vassal on the check and want Alexander Usyk to show. Still a bit cat and mouse, Carl. Yes, bit of a music. Unsure. He's not confident in committing. And there's Tony Bellew on the attack there. And Bellew will be the other way around. Music's had it all his own way. He's holding yeah. Manchester against Tony Bellew, who's got the backing of the crowd. This is unknown territory. Another great round for Tony Bellew. Yeah. Supreme round on the spin. I was not expecting this. I was expecting Tony Bellew to maybe pop shot, maybe throw one shot in the jabs. He's landing the body shots. He's completely controlling the rounds. And he's got Usyk looking a little desperate in there. Well, he's not very busy. But it, it 
to get into his world. Bit of a stand-up, but... Oh, oh big left hand from Usa. First real success from Eli, who takes it. Well, if Benio switches off against somebody like Usa, who's very cringe, he doesn't look for power. Benio's looking for power, so that slows the pitchers down. But doesn't Benio want it? But do we get it up close a bit later? And when well, Usa slows down a bit, so the Texas are... And this is better for the Ukrainian, and he's trying to set up the big left hand. Toad. That was a good right hand there from Tony Bellew. And that's what he's looking for. That oh, right hand right there. Big shot from Tony Bellew. Bellew's it. Well, Tony Bellew knew that he landed that right hand there. He didn't rush in. He's still trying to dig the punches in. Left hand gets through. Really nice think. right hand as well. Bellew's it just nuts. Oh, I mean, Tony Bellew landed big shots. Looking for him and landed them. As you see, backs him up. It doesn't have much of an effect and starts to feel the pace as it goes on there. It's bad news, some good work there as Tony Belly drives that power from Usyk, back comes Belly. Both fighting that time, he leaves it. He's trying to show that in there. Who would have thought Tony Belly would have it? I've never seen him fight this one. You're giving He's... nothing. I mean, I got, I, how do we sit winning that round, guys? I mean, Tony landed a couple of shots, but we can't make it. Tony kind of landed a couple of good shots that round, but I thought Usyk won the round. Tony agree with you, Paulie. I thought that was Usyk's best round. His confidence will not give Usyk the fact that he Began to get it. He had moments of success, but Bellu Anderson got writes poetry, loves solving puzzles. Great. So, so, you know, he would probably beat him, but you know, nobody's giving Tony Bellu a chance coming into this. Jusic now is having to force this and try and get something going while Tony Bellu's able to sit back and land. Good for me, Bellu. Usyk flawed in the amateurs with punches like that, but then he took out the machine. So many calling him Usyk. Looking for a lovely, quick countering left. The pressure's going to start heating up as this fight goes on. Good right hand from Benio. Well, Usyk's going to That's the danger. If Usyk finds a home for that jab, he'll be able to work yeah. that jab. Tony Benio does not want to sit there and let a poor jab land. Still the right hand from Benio. How does he not to the lane now? But that's good stuff from Tony Benio. And he's got it. Let's get over to Derek Chisora for his thoughts with Andy. <laughs> you are heading this fight? Ah, uh, Usyk needs a knockout. They both need a knockout. Because right now, I don't know, I, don't, I, I can't even score it right now. The ultimate challenge in what he promises is his last. The first and the fifth round, the, the two, two tight to call. 3-2 to Bellew. So close into the sixth round. Few people thought Let him get set, settled. Nice work from Bellew as he moves around. Against David Hay a couple of times. Against McCarvey. If, going, if this carries on, you expect it to start to he's turn some energy. He's thinking about and he's loading up with big power shots. You think it, it, it is very close. I've got Bellew ahead because round two, three, and four was good, but good right hand count there from Usyk looks comfortable. Good shot from big, Usyk right on the field. Really careless of Bellew. Big, biggest shot of the round. White belts on the line, the white and yellow of Alexander Usyk, who has definitely stepped it up dramatically. This fighter, Usyk. Growing in confidence. And it's a massive Aston. I think David Hayes has got something to say here. Yeah, the, the body shots from his body are sore from the start of this round. At the end of that round, his, his corner may start having more effect. Also, also Musik has changed his last hand. He's throwing differently. I've got to be honest, I'm looking concerned for Tony Bellew on his back foot as he sits on the team up here. Comes back with a combination, Bellew. The music's quality because that would be dangerous. 11 knock those 15 wins. and landed on Usyk as he was punching. Belly up again into the neutral corner. There's that left hand. Belly ran at heavyweight as we saw against David. And now he's going for it. Tries to turn it to the down. Tony Belly looking like he was getting a bit of a breather on the road for the majority. Since we cut the ring off, that's one adjustment. The second adjustment again is his left hand on the side. As we see in this replay here, it's coming in. For the uh, best that's ever lived. He wants to finish his cruiserweight. Rain here and then move up to heavyweight, but it's looking brighter for the Ukrainian, much brighter. Yes, that Physical was maneuvering around the wing. Bring up Usyk now. Belly backs into it because losing these rounds. Backing off with blood coming out of his mouth. Look at him in stabs and left crosses now, like that one. They send the blood splattering. Yeah, big left hand from Oleksandr from Usyk. And you can see Tony Belly wearing down, still looking for that right hand, still galleon, still brave. He's really closing this gap with, with real, you know, minimum oh, effort. Oh, 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 he lights out. Oh, it's Dave oh, Conwell straight oh, in the ring. I six, think he's going to stop it. Seven. And Alexander Usyk, his place as the world cruiserweight king. He had a rough start. Tony Bellew gave him problems early. It's a looping left cross there. 
which we've not seen yet on the replay, the full Tony Bellew down. Was a I'm going to disagree, he didn't come out of the pool. It was an adjustment for Usyk and made a couple of rounds ago, adjusting the way he threw that left hand. He, kept the right, he, he took his foot off the pace. And, you know, Usyk seemed to grow in confidence. More accurate. I noticed after round five, David, that, you know, Usyk was caught into the fight looking relaxed and confident. Tony Bellew was three rounds up on one card. One on well, Tony Bellew was boxing really well from the start. Well, there's the finish there. A couple there. of times before, but it was just a few rounds ago. And Bellew, when a guy adjusts to you, you have to adjust back. And Bellew never adjusted to that wide left hand. His reflexes and time, it seemed to slow as his energy did. So that shot there... Yeah, he's so then punches are amplified massively when you're exactly. tired. And you saw that, and there's the effect of that looping left cross that lands Great, right. brave performance, nothing to be ashamed of.